is a question you get a lot, right? Someone wants to renovate a house, they want to open up a kitchen. Their biggest concern is, I'm going to take down the wrong wall, the house is going to collapse. Yeah, how do I know if it's a load-bearing wall? So, how do you know it's a load-bearing wall? All right, well, it starts with the direction of the bearing joist, all right? Okay. What's carrying the floor? Let's go down into the basement. So, let's open up the front wall. This here? Yeah. Look at okay. you. This comes off. Right. So, now you get to look at the foundation. You get to look at the carrying beam right here and the joist resting on with lally columns in the middle. So two lally columns and that beam is running in this direction, same right. direction as these walls right here. Exactly. So let's slide this over so now you can uh, understand the relationship that. with everything. So okay. this direction, which is perpendicular to these floor joists. Correct. Now if you've got a load bearing wall that runs down here, you've got a load bearing wall here, and if it's another floor, there'd be a load bearing wall here, and so on down the line. And they're on top of each other, so it's transferring it down to the basement. Exactly. So if the wall 